Hello everyone, my name is Daniel Bacchieri. I'm a journalist, filmmaker and curator from Brazil. And uh, there is no doubt that music is my passion and I would like to share some fun things about B.B. King, Janis Joplin, Eric Clapton and Questlove. The four are great pop stars and they all began in the streets. They began in the streets the beginning, in the beginning of their career, so I want to connect the past with the future. <laughs> So a street music map is geolocating street musicians around the world. And uh, the project began as an Instagram account in 2014. And uh, right now, street music map features more than 1,200 1, street musicians from 93 countries. And more than 700 people collab be besides me uh, sharing uh, videos about street musicians into the street music map platform. One great news that we got this uh, semester is that the street music map got a Webby Award nomination and, uh, you know, like being, having competitors like Rolling Stone magazine and back. So it was pretty cool. And uh, during the semester, we got some uh, important press from BBC, Atlas Obscura, and HuffPost as well. Besides the Instagram, the next step was geolocating into a map. So right now, we are de developing our own map to identify the street musicians in different countries. From the map, we start to curate the playlists on Spotify. You can find on Spotify playlists from different cities featuring street musicians with original work. And here in New York, we launched the Street Music Map Radio. It's a podcast 100% about street musicians, and we are, interviewing, we are interviewing the buskers in the streets. It started in New York, and the next episode is, from a, is about a composer from Los Angeles. Where is the money? <laughs> I think is with branded content, we are already doing this. Havaianas is one of the biggest brands in Brazil, and uh, we curate a playlist of Havaianas back in February. Records. We launch a live record featuring street bands uh, from Brazil, and this record format, I truly believe that we can do it in New York, in London, in Berlin, all around the world, featuring original songs from street musicians. Live events as well. We organized uh, more than seven events in Brazil, and we want to start to promote events in US and Europe as well and digital tips. That would be the next step. You can donate for a musician watching from live streaming a musician in London and you are here in New York and vice versa. So like a local musician can get a global audience from a street music map. I don't do this by, just by myself. I curate, I research, I'm a reporter. You can name it, you can put any tag on me. I always wanna be a reporter. So I need a crew to work with me and to help me to monetize. Tel Marcus is the art designer, so this pretty cool logo is by Tel Marcus, and the map is being developed by Martin Rabalia directly from Argentina. And more than three people in the team. We have more than 700 collaborators around the world, and our goal is to turn these collaborators into street music map ambassadors. Thank you very much.